What if the US government helped bankroll a $1 trillion AI expansion, the biggest tech project in American history? Not a private startup, but OpenAI, the company behind ChatGPT, could soon be backed by US taxpayers to build the physical backbone of artificial intelligence. Massive data centers, energy projects, chip factories, a new digital America. This isn't science fiction, it's a real proposal discussed between OpenAI and the US government. A $1 trillion AI infrastructure plan with partners like Microsoft, Amazon Web Services, and Oracle could make the US the global capital of AI power. But who pays, who profits, and who controls the world's next superpower, compute? OpenAI isn't asking for cash, it's asking for loan guarantees. This means the government promises to cover losses, making it easier for OpenAI and its partners to raise private money. It's a financial safety net. Tesla's 2010 loan guarantee was $465 million. This proposal is over 100 times bigger, nearly half of America's entire $1.7 trillion discretionary budget. $1 trillion could fund two NASA programs, three highway systems, or every student loan payment in the country for years. This money is for super-scale AI factories, giant data centers running millions of chips, pulling gigawatts of energy, cooled by rivers, and guarded like nuclear sites. Its data meets power plants. The goal is to expand US, compute, capacity so AI companies don't rely on foreign hardware or energy grids. It's a national AI ecosystem, energy infrastructure, chip manufacturing, supply chains, and jobs. Tens of thousands of engineers, electricians, and technicians could be needed across dozens of states. Critics warn this could centralize power in a few hands, OpenAI, Microsoft, and Amazon controlling the new AI grid. If they control compute, they control access and price. If it fails, taxpayers foot the bill. Some call it corporate welfare. AI data centers already consume as much power as small cities. Scale that up by a trillion dollars, and we're talking grid wars over electricity and water. Meanwhile, countries like China, South Korea, and the EU are racing to build their own, sovereign AI stacks. NVIDIA is investing billions globally. Sam Altman says this plan would be like the interstate highway system for AI, a digital backbone connecting innovation across America. Would you want a mega data center in your state if it meant jobs and power lines? Hit follow to stay up to date. Thanks for watching.